Hey amazing creators, welcome back to the channel. Today in this video, we show you how to color grade your footage manually and using filters and make your footage cinematic. Want to learn color grading? Keep watching! Before we begin, if you haven't already installed Wondershare Filmora, please visit the official website and download the latest version. Then install it on your computer. Also remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Color grading is essential for all the footage to make it look catchier and cinematic, and in Filmora is quite easy to color grade your footage in two ways. Manual color grading. To get started with your footage, just drop it onto the timeline. For some manual color grading, head over to the color settings, scroll down, and find the color options. First things first, let's set the mood. If you're aiming for an intense vibe, gently drag the temperature slider to the right. If you prefer a softer feel, slide it to the left. Next up, Adjust the vibrance to really bring out those muted colors, and don't be shy about slightly increasing the saturation for a bit more pop. Hop over to the Light Adjustment section. Here, you can tweak settings like Exposure, Brightness, Contrast, Highlights, Shadows, Whites, and Blacks. The best part? These adjustments will really help bring your footage to life, so feel free to play around with them until it looks just right. Next up is the HSL section, which stands for Hue, Saturation, and Luminance. This is where you can focus on the individual colors in your video, adjust their saturation and brightness to make them pop. Now, let's move on to the curves. They're super handy for getting precise control over your color and brightness. You can even use curves to give your footage a unique creative style. Start by placing points on the highlight, midtone, and shadow on the Y curve, then adjust them to enhance the overall vibe. Don't forget to create points on the RGB curves too, and play with those settings. Finally, we arrive at the color wheel. Here, you can tweak the highlights, midtones, and shadows, and even change their colors. It's a fun way to add your personal touch to your video. All right, let's have some fun with effects. Head over to the Effects tab and type Flare in the search bar. You'll see a bunch of cool options pop up. Just drag and drop the Light Effect 02 onto a new track, and then feel free to adjust the flare opacity to your liking. It's amazing to see the difference. Here's a before and after comparison. Let's dive into using filters for some awesome cinematic color grading. First, place your footage onto the timeline. Next, head over to the Filters tab, where you'll find a variety of filters for all types of videos. Navigate to the Cinematic folder and just drag and drop the filters right onto your footage. Feel free to mix and match. Starting with the Cine Rich filter, then adding the Blue Bear filter and finishing off with Sunlit Siesta. After that, you can tweak each filter's opacity in the effect settings to get your perfect look. Once that's done, you can compare the before and after to see the transformation. And if you want to take it a step further, consider adding some extra effects to make your color-graded footage even more captivating. These are the two ways to make your footage more cinematic with color grading. Download Filmora 14 from the link in the description and make your footage catchier. If you found it helpful, give us a big thumbs up and share it with fellow creators and editors. If you are interested in visual effects and tutorials, check out filmora.wondershare.com. See you in the next video.